Hey everybody, welcome to Board Online, Board Offline. Today we have the second half of March's solo games currently crowdfunding on Kickstarter. So this will cover games that are solo capable, crowdfunding, actually not just Kickstarter, we do have a game found game today as well. And they all have uh, solo capabilities and their funding between the 16th and the 31st of March. So with anything else, we're gonna do this in three minutes starting now. So the first game is going to be Mageling Rise of the Ancient Ones. Now Rise of the Ancient Ones is actually an expansion for Mageling. Here's the original game apparently. I actually had not heard of this before, but this is your chance to get the base game and the new expansion, which, which looks like a huge expansion. Uh, $10,000 raised so far. It's a, uh, you're trying to stop an apop apocalyptic cult in a dice placement tableau building adventure game. So as you're playing through this, you can see here's uh, a good look at the artwork, which is pretty cool in the game and the general layout. Uh, this is one of the games where you're, you're going to be rolling dice and you can re-roll dice, you know, a couple times to get what you're trying to, trying to get. You're going to put some matching dice on this board to gain resources and stuff. You're going to buy cards with those resources that then can be activated by placing matching dice um, uh, on the cards and so, or with the cards and stuff like that. Non-matching dice have a use as well. They can, uh, what does it say here? They, you activate your power up, place non-matching dice onto your power up to alter the, your radiance. So there's, there's a use for the non-matching dice as well and just a ton of stuff going on in this game and I've already gone on too long about it. Number two is Lobotomy 2 Manhunt. This is over on GameFound. This is a uh, asylum crawler rather than a dungeon crawler and you're gonna be going through all kinds of stuff going on in this game where uh, basically you're trying to escape this asylum uh, you're able to upgrade your uh, equipment and and you actually use madness as it, it, it powers you up in this game but obviously you want to be careful with with it as well uh, a ton of different minis a ton of different bad guys in this game uh, you're gonna be able to get in on this one for uh, $79 will get you in on the base game obviously they had the larger $200 pledge here this is an expansion the Inferno expansion and then just a ton of stuff in the base game here as well. And the artwork, of course, is just that really kind of dark, but also over the top type stuff that I, I really enjoy. And then the final game, and full disclosure, I may be doing uh, some Kickstarter work for uh, a promotion for Monster Pit uh, in the near future, possibly. I'm not sure yet. But Monster Pit is also my number one for uh, the second half of March. This is a co-op boss battle. This is from the same uh, people that brought you, uh, what was it? Um, Anyway, there was another game that had this same artwork here. I wish I could remember the name of it. But, oh, Catacombs, there it is. But this is not a, a dexterity game at all. This is a completely new style of game, and you're gonna be play. you gotta play co-op or one versus many, apparently. There's a couple different game modes there. But there's gonna be a monster that's going along this track here that's trying to break into the fort, and the players are going to be rolling dice and comparing them to the monster's dice and and hiring, you know, that's the end of my time, hiring people for defense and offense and, and a lot of different things going on there. All these different cards here, I believe, are uh, characters you can hire. And you can see the artwork is, I mean, if, I mean, if you like the Catacombs artwork, you're going to like this artwork. I really think it's cool artwork. I, I've, I thought when they, um, I'm pretty sure that new artwork for Catacombs was, was part of the third edition and wasn't the original artwork. And I, I liked, I liked it a lot. So a lot going on here. Uh, but yeah, those are the three games crowdfunding on Kickstarter and Game Found the 16th through the 31st of March. Be sure to get on here. Check the links in the description below uh, to get yourself over to their various pages. Thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, if you're bored online, bored offline. Mm -hmm.